show you how easy it is to connect Excel to data in Business Central. The first thing you have to do is find the OData URL in Business Central, and then go into Excel, attach Excel to that data. Then you can format in Excel any way you want to. You can use the functionality in Excel to create pivot tables, to create graphs. You can also refresh the data. So let's take a look at it. So the first thing to do is look at the web services. I want to look for the one for vendors. Let's use this one right here. I'm going to right click, copy the link address. Then I want to go into a brand new Excel spreadsheet. I'm going to go to the data tab, get data from other sources from the OData feed. Now I'm already logged in. You may have to log in with your organizational account. I'm just going to paste the URL here, hit OK. I can preview the data here. I'm going to load it into the Excel spreadsheet. And from here, I can use this data any way I want. So what I typically do is I'm going to insert a pivot table. It makes it easier to organize the data. So let's just click on Summarize with Pivot Table. I'm going to create a quick pivot table. Pull in the name down here as a row. Pull in the balance over here. Let me just format this data. What I want to do is I'm just going to add a graph. I can insert a graph. It's that easy. So what I can do with this functionality is in this Excel spreadsheet, I can create a number of pivot tables off that basic data, create graphs. I can put all those graphs into one page to show it kind of a dashboard. This is a good way to get used to working with data in Business Central and start mocking up some dashboards that could be important to you. So if we look at the spreadsheet the way it is here, we got the basic query here, and this is the pivot table. I can have multiple pivot tables based on the same data. And then what I can also do is I can refresh the data here. So what I'm going to do is off the video, I'm going to make a payment to this first up consultants. And we'll refresh the data and see how that changes the graph. So in Business Central, I created a payment for first up consultants of around $5,000. So now all I have to do is refresh the data in this spreadsheet. So you can see when I refresh the data, it updated the amounts in my Excel spreadsheet, but it saved all the formatting. So this is an important tool to have regenerative reporting right out of Business Central. Mm -hmm.